Good morning, Park Hill South, and welcome to the South Side Scoop. My name is Lennon Carlson. And I'm Madison Flynn. Today is November 7th, and it is a purple day. Well, Madison, this fall sports season has been incredible for everyone. I drove by the uh, stadium on Friday and saw we were absolutely killing it in football. Yes, our football boys did amazing. Celebration was in the air Friday night at Preston Field. The Panthers triumphed over the Fort Osage Indians at a 37-6 to advance to state quarterfinals against Staley next week. Now at 10-1, the team's phenomenal season continues. But no matter what happens next, Friday night's achievement will remain a highlight for years to come. If you want to support our boys, be sure to ride the Spirit Bus at no cost to Staley on Friday for the game. Remember, admission is $7. Well, boys, football isn't the only thing that's doing amazing still. Absolutely. There are so many teams, and uh, just all the sports here at South are doing incredible yeah. this year. Yeah, girls cross country is running on. The girls cross country team placed fourth at the state meet this weekend in Jefferson City. In the closest team finish ever at the state cross country meet, with only 12 points separating first and fifth place. Congratulations to the team for their amazing races and team performance to earn a spot on the podium. This is the first state trophy for Park Hill South in cross, class four cross country. Team members are Jasmine Crawford, Kelly Danielson, Marty Height, Lexi Maddox, Mallory Michelle, Emma Roth, Olivia Roth, and Paige Snyder. Jasmine Crawford and Lexi Maddox also earned all state honors for finishing in the top 25 on Saturday. New to the scoop. Congratulations to Anita Welty. She is a finalist for the Ele Evelyn Gates Award. It is an award given to the best volleyball player in the Metro from both the Missouri and Kansas side. If you see her or have her in class, please congratulate her today. Congratulations to the boys swim team for their outstanding performance at state. All state honors include the sixth place 200 free relay made up of Cody Beeler, Jackson Garrett, Isaac Lee, and Daniel Miller. Jackson Garrett broke the school record in the 100 backstroke and finished fourth at state, earning all state honors. Daniel Miller broke the school record and also received all state honors in the 100 breaststroke, finishing eighth. In the 50 free, Daniel Miller finished 12th. In the 500 free, Connor Morris finished 15th. Stay tuned. Later this week, we will find out more about orchestra and band at districts. And that's what's new to the scoop. Tickets are now on sale at lunch for the hilarious Monty Python musical Spamalot. You won't want to miss this award-winning show. Make sure to buy your tickets for performances on November 10th, 11th, and 12th. Tickets are just $9. There will be an informational baseball meeting on Wednesday, November 9th at 2.05 p.m. The meeting will be in room A101 for all freshmen through senior students interested in playing baseball this year. If you are un unable to attend the meeting on Wednesday, please see Coach McDaniels for more information. On the lunch menu today is meatloaf, fisherman's combo, giant cheese ravioli, kale apple salad, and the premium meal is Asian buffet. Well, today's happy birthdays today go out to Tanner Jones and Savannah Bourne. I think that's how you say that. If it's not, I apologize. That's all we've got for you today on the Southside Scoop. I'm Lennon Carlson. And I'm Madison Flynn. Have a great day, Park Hill South.